My name's Artie Burt. I run a suckler to beef farm here in County Down, just at the tip of the Arts Peninsula. We cows are predominantly Sim Limbs and Charlie Terminal Sire. We take everything through to beef and bucket rear a few calves as well. We're up on cow numbers. We had a very tight calving spring herd of 180-ish and 190 cows and we had seven stock bulls. We found that the stock bulls finished up lying about all year. They were only needed a few weeks. We finished up then, you had, although you maybe only needed four or five bulls, you always had young bulls that needed small groups. You always needed a spare bull because at some stage during the year something got hurt. We found then they were lying about you had seven bulls in the house, it was costing too much to keep them. We started looking at another option. Yeah, we were involved with the joint Hillsborough and Chuggis research trial back in 2014. Um, we found, we got conception results of between 60 and 72-ish percent to first service. We have been using uh, synchronization since probably back as far as 2012. Um, we have found as a, it is a good tool to keep the calving interval tight. Um, we, were, we would have used it on late calvers to pull them forward, the stragglers. You can go in from 30 days and you can tighten them up. But we also found that you, had, you were more focused on a breeding season. You had a start date and a finish date and you didn't have a rogue bull floating about that you needed a home for and you were inclined to let Calvin linger on. Uh, typically we would have done a fixed time AI, would have got everything served once. We would then have possibly either done repeat AI, depending on the availability of, of sweeper bulls, or sweeper bull, the sweeper bull could have alternated between two batches of cows and would have probably done that twice. And we were only focused on repeat AI with a batch of cows uh, you would only have been focused for two five-day windows whenever they were due to repeat and repeat again. You weren't all the time continuously watching, watching cows. Uh, the most number of cows we ever synchronised on one particular day was 81 and there's a natural spread anyway in cows um, from the cow that calves 10 days early to the one that will run over 14 days or so late. We would have 12 cabin pens to 180 cows. It wasn't a huge issue calving that many cows. Uh, would use to our advantage, would use typically, use the gestation length of the bull to your advantage. You could use a shorter gestation limousine, hope to get them calved before the longer gestation Charlies maybe come in. One, another advantage that I see in doing this you're able to negotiate prices because you're doing so many. You can you can say you can phone the vet and you can ask them their price and you can negotiate it, or you can negotiate your AI technician what he's going to cost. You bulk buy your semen. You can get the semen of genetically better bulls. You can use the figures as a po figures will have accuracy as opposed to the the stock bull. No matter how good your stock bull is, your figures will not be as nearly as accurate or the, the as what you'll get out of the, an AI catalogue.